What's going on guys? It's your boy DPJ here today with another Destiny video and in today's video we are taking a look at an answering cord. Now this is a Vanguard Auto Rifle obtainable from the Vanguard Quartermaster in the tower. To obtain it you'll need to be a rank 3 and have 150 legendary marks. Now if you look on any forum or any video or you're listening on anyone's combo where people are talking about weapons for PvP, not too many auto rifle names will pop up as they are indeed really under par with other weapon types even after the 2.0 patch, auto rifles still feel weak compared, they really do. But if you do see the mention of an auto rifle on forums or in videos, it's normally this one right here, an answering cord. Now a pal of mine made a video on this actual weapon, Easy Now 1337, he stated it was the best PvP auto rifle in the game. He kept on at me about this damn weapon, so I decided to give it a chance, and straight away I saw where he was coming from. I fell in love with it instantly. It felt really good to use and it really does pack a great punch, and it drops enemies really quick, something I didn't really think was possible with auto rifles until recent. Now I didn't purchase mine from the Vanguard, mine came out of a blue engram and to be honest I've had a few of these so they ain't actually really rare. My version seen on screen now has different mods to the one you can get from the Vanguard Quartermaster so let's go through them. Well to start mine has three great sights, the SL012, the SPO28 and the SRO37 all coming in handy in certain situations. It also has a few mods to mix things up like most Suros weapons. On the second column we have hammer forged or oiled frame. On the third column we have speed reload or hand laid stock. And finally we have rodeo. Now with this weapon I'd say get as much range and stability as you can and that's indeed what I have here. So the roll I have isn't bad at all. So let's take a look at its PvP stats. While this weapon fires 8 bullets per second, so it shoots 480 rounds per minute, it will empty its standard clip of 27 bullets in 3.33 seconds. Its reload and ready time is just under that 2 second mark. PvP damage, it does 25 to the head and 20 to the body, but remember that's only really at close quarters. Auto rifle damage fall off is crazy bad in Destiny, it really is. Damage per second to the head is 200 and damage per second to the body is 160. Maximum clip damage is 675 so you can easily take out 3 guardians if you are accurate. So this weapon is really capable in PvP of doing serious damage and although auto rifles ain't where I believe they should be, they are definitely on the right course. Now to answer the question that many people will be asking, do I think this is the best auto rifle in the game so far? In short, I'd say no, it ain't. If you missed my video yesterday, I posted a video on another auto rifle, another Suros weapon, the ARI-45, which is basically the same as this, but it has way more stability as standard, so you have way more to work with. And if you missed that video and do want to check it out, I will link it in the video description. But to be honest, the answering cord is easily the second best auto rifle I have used so far. Guys, if you have this weapon, tell me what mod you've got linked down below in that comment section. If you've used it in PvP, let me know your opinion on it. Guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Do drop a like, I'd appreciate the support. Subscribe for Daily Destiny, and I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace out until next time. Peace! Get around.